Hey, I'm Joe. I'm from Newton Abbott in Devon. Uh, originally from Essex, summer of 2010, me and my wife uh, went down to Newton Abbott to church plant, Baptist church from scratch. The old Baptist church had shut down at the end of 2008. And uh, so we were set to explore new ways of being church and planting something that was different to the traditional inherited model of church that we see. Yeah, I mean, we're, we're still very new and organic. I need to meet in a couple of months, but we, we meet on Saturday afternoon and we gather together in our home at the moment. Uh, we eat together, so we share a meal, we share our lives, uh, explore together how our weeks have been going, what's going on. We, we break bread every week, so we have communion together, we pray, we listen to scripture and we respond to scripture, discussing it, exploring the different themes and how it impacts our lives. And we make a big deal about uh, sharing with each other uh, who we are, and allowing each other just to simply be ourselves and to uh, be open and honest and real with each other. So it's um, it's very raw and very real and exciting actually, very exciting. I was working for a very traditional Baptist church before and uh, kind of preparing for a Sunday service and preaching and service plans and all my time was spent doing that and realized that a lot of our time, a lot of my time, um, was no longer spent praying or actually meeting with people who didn't know Jesus. So when we got to Newton Abbott, um, God, God really touched our hearts in terms of making sure we were people of prayer. Uh, when we got there, prayer was and still is foundational for what we're about. Prayer walking, committing ourselves and devoting ourselves to prayer and praying for the community and for people. And then uh, making sure we spent loads and loads of time with people who didn't know Jesus. So being in the places where they were, in pubs and in coffee bars and in community groups. And out of praying and out of being with people who didn't know Jesus, um, God very organically and naturally enabled the church to be born um, just over a year after we got there. And this fledgling group of people started to get together to explore who Jesus was and disciple each other. And... Um, <laughs> I'd encourage anyone really to remember that at the heart of it all lies prayer and love for God, love for each other and out of that I believe God will build church um, and to be faithful to what church is, to not try and be gimmicky or pretend that we're not church but to be faithfully be church in a way where people actually share lives to me. I very naturally want to see how things develop week by week, I want to naturally simply listen to the spirit to the wind of the spirit, to how he's blowing, and uh, you know, I want to be a blessing on what God is already doing, and so simply listening to God and faithfully serving Him, and week by week, just seeing what happens, going wherever the wind of the spirit blows, and engaging with people wherever He leads, and so praying for opportunity to meet people on a weekly basis, for lives to be shared on a weekly basis, and to be open to the stranger, to the person that I don't know, and asking God to introduce me to someone that I don't know every week and, and beginning a new relationship with them.